Good afternoon, students. Good afternoon, Miss Paula. All right, today I have an activity so we can all can enjoy. I think it's very useful. All right, here I have apple, 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 and apple. Delicious, originally from Iowa. Golden Delicious from West Virginia. And Granny Smith came all the way from Australia. Hmm. In Australia. It's another continent that if you look in the club, you'll see that's a piece of land. Actually, Australia is very, very, very interesting because it's the only continent in the whole world that has the same country named Australia. We'll talk about it later. Yes. And you know what? I have a question. When I see these apples, I wonder where can you find these apples? Mm, yes. In store. In the store. Mm, like Safeway and Big Meyer? Yes. Where else can we find them? Yes. The farm. In the farm. Mm, yes. And what about you? In my backyard. <gasps> in your backyard. Mm, I wish I could have apples in my backyard. Well, you know what? I have a picture of these. See? When you were saying about the farm, see? Apple farm. That's what That's my right. tree in my backyard looks like. Yes, see? You have an apple tree? Yeah. Mm. Can you bring us that one? Sure. Wow. Elizabeth have apple tree in her backyard. Yeah, I'm going to pass it around so you can see. And it's not just in Washington, in our Bush state that we have apple farm, but all around the world. Apple is very, very good start of nutrition. Everyone, like, not everyone, but everywhere in the world you can find apple tree. Guess what? These are the farmer in a different place in the world. I believe this is Japan. I believe this is somewhere in Africa. And... This is in Washington, in our state. Here you go, you can. But guess what? Not just the farmer that I have a picture, but I have product that mm, look a little bit different than this. I will show you guys, and can you guys tell me what it is? Anyone t can tell me what this Ooh, is? Anyone? Yummy. Yes. What is this? Elizabeth? Apple pie. Apple pie. What about this one? Juice. Oh, what kind juice. of juice? Apple. Apple juice. Apple juice. And what about this one? Apple sauce. Apple sauce. I wonder. Do you guys ever wonder where did we find these kind of products? And how did it actually came about? Do you know how we find it at the store? This, yes, we can find it in the store, but guess what? In order to make these stuff, this product, we use apples, different kind of apple. I'm going to pass these pictures around so you can see. So, all of that is made out of apples? Yes, all these made out of apples. Sometimes, if you look in the package, when you look... This is not red. I know, right? Isn't it amazing how different it could be? Red apple, golden and green makes kind of yellow juice. All right, but anyway, I will show you guys. This is the pictures of Washington State. And these point, this is right here where we are. It says Seattle, who might be down south. Seattle. Yes, for Seattle, yes, in Seattle. But here, you see the pictures 
of the apples. These are the place where you can find a lot of apple farms. Especially, I have been to Banashi, Banashi, and I see a lot of apple tree there. And guess what, guys? Today, I am going to show you guys how to cut an apple <gasps> with a knife. Yes, with a knife. A real one? A real knife. But oh. guess what, guys? Yes, it is very really dangerous to work with a knife. So that's why I'm asking you guys to keep your hand to your lap. We might cut our fingers. I know, I will be the one who cut. But I want you to see and check. Because I know that at some point in your life, you guys will get a chance to work with a knife. Yeah. I have my knife. It's basically in cover. So if you touch it now, it will hurt you. But when I take it out from the cover, it might hurt. So I'm going to put it here. That's like pretty. I know, right? And here I have my plate and a bowl. A cutting board. Oh, so I know. Yeah, we are going to place the bowl. Is that apple juice? This is water. It's clean water to wash that down. I have I already... Thank you. <laughs> I borrowed it from a friend. She was really nice. I have this apple. This is Granny Smith. Can you say Granny Smith? Granny, Granny Smith. Smith. Came all the way. Originally, originally from Australia. Yes. Wow. So, I have already washed the apple, I pee watch it, but I like to be safe. I always double wash my fruit. Whatever you put it in your mouth, you have to make sure that it's clean. So I have my bowl. Are we going to taste all the apples? We'll see if you like to have some. This is my knife. My granny likes green apples. Ah, mm. I'm going to be cutting. I'll show you. I learned how to cut apple from a special thing. So I'm going to put half of my apple in there so you can see. to cut this apple from Montessori school. This is exactly how my teacher wanted. So I practice and then I cut exactly the way the teacher showed me. Why are you put it in water? So I can clean my apple because even though I wash my hand the, even from the outside you wash it from the inside? Yes. Some people don't wash the inside I like to wash because I'm going to be sharing this apple with you and I'm using my hand to touch the apple. But even though I, I already washed and cleaned my hand, but it's always safe to have to wash an apple. Oh, wow. one and pass it along so your friends can enjoy. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Would you like to have one? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Miss Paula. Thank you. Okay, oh, it's this. so sour. We're gonna say this. Mm -hmm. I don't really know, but I think it's because of the different type of apple. That's why. This is called Del delicious. Oh, yeah, I think it's because of the color. It looks more like yellow. 
and delicious because it's more delicious. Mm, I hope so. on a project recording. Oh, 
What about the red delicious? Not so good? Don't no, remember? I, I remember. That's okay. Remember. What about the Fuji? <gasps> Came all the way from Japan. Sweet and sour. Ah, sweet and sour. You wouldn't be able to tell because you didn't taste, but that's okay, right? All right. Anyway, mm, I wonder what was this whole activity? What was your favorite thing? One thing that you like or remember? Can you guys tell the class? I really like how it's not just one apple, it's a lot of apples. Mm -hmm. They don't come from the same place, they come from all over the place. What about you, Pahe? Some of them have a very, very cute name, and they're actually some of them might be friends, right? Like yeah. Granny Smith. Granny That's Smith. That's a funny name. Like Granny Smith. Yes, I know. And did you know that Fuji, the apple Fuji that came all the way from Japan, there's a mountain here with big mountain. Yeah. Fuji mountain too. Wow. I wonder whether the oh. apple tree. I wonder. I had no idea, but guess what? I have Japanese friends. Maybe I'll go ask her and find out why they called it Fuji. Oh, thank you for matching all the cards. Yes. And you know what? We're gonna wrap this up, and then we'll go off, choose our work, and guess what, guy? Tonight, before you. Go to sleep. Think of who we should thank when you go and shopping for apples. Oh, apple uh, farmer. Yes. And guess what? Anyone could be a farmer, girl, boy. Anyone can be a farmer. And farmer, those people who are working and try to make this beautiful product for us to eat. You know, they grow crop. They have to be outside. They have to get them under the sun. Grow these crops, beautiful crops, and very delicious ones. All right. And if you guys want to see and support the local farmer, go to farmer market. Yeah, it, yeah, yes. Shop with them, buy their stuff, so we can support them. All right. Well, let's finish and wrap up our work here, and let's go. Thank you. Bye. Bye.